अरे There is difference between amount of fuel emitted and the quantity of charge yes, being sir. admitted. Because in petrol engine, you are admitting charge, which means the mixture of air and fuel. Okay. And yes. and in diesel engine, you are taking same amount of air every time, but in changing the uh, quantity of uh, quantity fuel of the fuel being injected. So, uh, what's happening is you are changing the air fuel ratio in uh, diesel engines. Which changes the quality of the uh, charge, basically. So that's why there is qualitative government uh, governing, and uh, in petrol engine you are just changing the uh, like total. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you are not actually. Yeah, yeah. So actually you are not changing the quality of the fuel or like which. Yeah, yeah, right. this is yes 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 this is what i have learned i mean like, that's what i was able to capture so if i'm wrong this time yeah sure yes hey rega hello hello yeah what is the hit and go hit and run governor uh so heat and miss yeah, is generally used in uh, multi cylinder engines so basically you are skipping some cylinders or i think it's done in single cylinder you are just missing firing in some uh, like some uh, let's say you have four in uh, cylinders and then and you are running at the optimum speed and you don't need that much uh, like power at the top then you can skip firing in two cylinders or like firing in one cylinder You can skip the fire. Basically, you can just skip firing it for. Let's say, uh, just I just try to give it a. Hello, 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 yeah. hello. Basic, hello. Basically, you means that if you have the four to six cylinder, you have to cut out like two to three cylinder. So only two, uh, one or two cylinder is uh, used to used to rotate that crankshaft. It is uh, same like that. One or two cylinders are skipped. what yeah again uh, you also record because i have uh, some internet issues so you also record and i will also send my recording then we will compare because uh, sometimes uh, internet is very unstable here okay yeah okay huh. hey, hey. hello hello anyone have that uh, like uh, quality and quantity governor and hit and miss uh, run uh, governor notes so can you send it on group kamlesh actually i don't have note but i will share whatever i could find okay okay no problem i think i i just uh, watched some videos on uh, youtube 
Yeah, but I if you, I have to just go and uh, check which video it was. So if I'm not able to find, just you can Google it on the uh, you can search it on YouTube. There are plenty. Okay, 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 okay. If I find some note or like something, I'll just do share it. Okay. okay. I think both of them are one guy was Hello. who was in uniform. Hello. Oh uh, now I'm marine engineering because I'm not doing DG protocols. Yeah, I am you. I am I am as Goa. Yeah. No, no, I am actually in a senior office of technology, Mangalore. Fine layer, fine layer, fine layer, fine some. Synergy sponsorship. Uh, I am uh, I am as Goa, both. Bro, uh, yeah, there's a golden opportunity for you. MSC has released a sponsorship program for marine engineering. Few hours ago only. Uh, and yeah, MSC wala ne marine engineering ke liye nikala hai abhi. Abhi thodi der pehle hai. Has ready. No, no, yeah, yeah, come, 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 upcoming like September. That's upcoming the August, year, August. Year. Actually, I am now in marine engineering, final year. But in our college, is not DG approved. So that's why we want to join in ship, must be doing GME. Otherwise, we can't say. Pilot. Yeah. Ah, many students, many students are in our college also. They are in that group. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Yeah, it's possible because you can calculate uh, uh, horsepower. using brake horsepower, you can calculate indicator horsepower and uh, by the formula of indicator horsepower, which is equal to uh, like IP is equal to PLAN. Yeah. Okay, so by size of engine, you are supposed to specify. You are supposed to specify the stroke length and the bore of the piston, or like bore of the cylinder. I think that's what he is asking. Hello, 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 hello. My question is like, yes, yes, Kamlesh. So we have, so we get the IP from PML and formula. <laughs> so how we get the BP? For BP, okay, the use, formula yeah. of efficiency is like efficiency is like BP by IP. That is means break power by integrate power.
तर कॅन यू शेअर इट ऑन ग्रुप आय डोंट हॅव दॅट प्रॉब्लेम टाईप इट टाईप इट ट्राय टू टाईप इट नो ने आर फॉर हॅलो हॅलो वी कॅन कॅल्क्युलेटेड हॅलो फ्रॉम इंडिकेटर इंडिकेटर कॉक और एनिथिंग वी कॅल्क्युलेट द आय पी ओके दॅट इज आय पी इज इक्वल टू पी एम दॅट मीन्स मिनी इफेक्टिव्ह प्रेशर लेंथ ऑफ स्ट्रोक एरिया अँड द आर पी एम ऑफ द इंजिन डिवाइड बाय सिक्स्टी फ्रॉम दॅट वी कॅल्क्युलेट द इंडिकेटेड हॉर्स पॉवर सो हाव वी कॅल्क्युलेट द ब्रेक पॉवर फ्रॉम द इंडिकेटेड पॉवर कॉज फ्रॉम वी रिक्वायर डिफिशियन्सी फॉर दॅट ना फॉर अक्वायरिंग द बी पी वी रिक्वायर डिफिशियन्सी ना सो हाव वी वेन इफिशियन्सी कम ब्रेक पॉवर फ्रॉम द इंडिकेट पॉवर देअर इज अ लाईक ट्रान्समिशन लॉसेस आफ्टर दॅट इंडिकेटेड पॉवर ना सो इफ द इंडिकेट पॉवर इज द पॉवर डेव्हलप्ड इन साइड फ्रिक्शन बिकॉज ऑफ द ट्रान्समिशन so because yeah. of the transmission losses or the rotating of the shaft so uh, some amount of the power is taken from the cam shaft some power is required to rotate the flywheel and after that flywheel and cam shaft we gated the bhp that is the break of break of power there is a no direct such a relationship between uh, like hello can we just ignore the transmission losses because <laughs> one formula is there okay what it is uh, friction power is equal to ip minus bp that one formula is there no yeah but we don't know the value of uh, friction loss bp na bp or fp ha ha correct ha hello 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 i have got a question the it is a shaped volume or the total volume of the cylinder that means the clearance volume and the shaped volume what is the cc shaped volume piston has more i think uh, it is the total volume of the cylinder like the uh, uh, portion above the tdc and the tdc to bdc no area into length once uh, pranit sir has uh, explained that the piston area multiplied by length is a stroke right so uh, area is a centimeter square and uh, length is a centimeter so a centimeter cube will come so the cc means cubic centimeter means uh, it is a stroke length the amount uh, how much piston has moved in the cylinder okay okay
and another uh, you told uh, p- power is equal to torque multiplied by rpm it's not rpm it's angular velocity radian per second so ta- torque multiplied by omega right that is uh, no radian t into omega right power hello okay. hello hello what i recall is the uh, according to me the brake power is calculated from the device like the pony brake dynamometer someone hear about that what can you repeat question the internet got disconnected can you repeat the question once okay uh, uh that uh, power uh, power we calculate no that divided by 746 that is what the uh, sir has told but uh, bhp first of plan p mean l into l a n divided by 60 is there no that mean pressure is calculated first then after that uh, you will get the power so from power divided by 746 uh, you will get, uh, get the bhp like that uh, sir has told in uh, explainer no 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 ip ihp number of revolutions okay ha ha okay mm mm-hmm. Sorry, uh, I just I answer that question you just asked, but uh, I have another doubt. Uh, we are just asked to guess the size, right? So, yeah, yeah, yeah. So if that question is being asked to me, I'll just give the arbitrary value. Or, I mean, not the arbitrary, actually, just approximate value. You and I just calculate using P L N. I'll give the approximate value. This should be have size like slightly bigger than this. hello hello what are, can you repeat it can you repeat it come no uh, let's say uh, if you ask me as well like, you are asking me the question and you give me the uh, engine output power okay so bhp depends on lot of variables okay. we, uh, let's say if you are trying to calculate the bhp of car okay then you will calculate at tires okay first thing tire at uh, yeah at tire and 
you are trying to calculate bhp for a sole engine or like only engine then you will calculate it at output shaft there will be no transmission okay ए नो द आउटपुट शाफ्ट तुम्हें सी एस एच पी सर टोल नो एस एच पी मतलब दाफ्ट हॉर्स पावर एस एच पी वन वन लेक्चर इज देर सी एस एच पी बी एच पी एंड आई एच पी करके टोटल पावर यू जनरेट इन दिस्टन हाँ यस ओके वॉट इज ब्रेक हॉर्स पावर यू गेट एट द आउटपुट शाफ्ट Huh. As okay. far as I know. Okay. And after the cam shaft and after the flywheel, ah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Obviously, at the output shaft, I mean, uh, the shaft which will uh, the crank shaft which will protrude out of uh, the casing and which you will connect to your transmission. Okay. Yes. So. Yeah. So I think if you are yeah, asking I... me to just for us, you know. Like, only for a engine then i don't think it, there will be lot of losses yes 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 so this is the shp like thrust power mean effective power this is in case of the two stroke marine engines cause two stroke marine engines have the longer propeller shaft mm -hmm. that means the length of the propeller shaft is too long for that we have the maximum power losses over there but in case of engine we don't have that too much longer shaft just we have that like uh, indicate horsepower and ss that is the bhp brake horsepower after yeah. the power giving that uh, crank shaft or cam shaft or that uh, uh, flywheel yes but uh, i will just try to find out more about that because i don't think that's if they uh, like, that's not very correct answer it just you got to answer it इतना बोल लिया पर कंक्लूजन अभी भी नहीं निकला है क्या बताना है I don't think you uh, could be able to find out the exact value. Sir, I mean, sir has told power calculated in flywheel is called as brake horse power. I wrote it, uh, wrote the notes. Means yeah, yeah. Power calculated I mean, flywheel. Yes, yes, yes. Flywheel is basically which uh, flywheel is mounted on the same shaft at the output shaft. Ah huh, yes. Yeah yeah. 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 Right. yeah. And if you are considering to uh, let's let's say uh, we have two bikes. First one is uh, bullet 350 cc and the KTM 390 cc. 390 or 350 cc, I don't know. 390 is there. So let's say there are there. Uh, assume that their piston uh, cc uh, like amount of cc is same for both the bikes. Even if uh, even then you will get different BHP values like brake horsepower values on dynamometer because of the tuning and the gear boxes. So. the brake horse power is basically you measure at the most output end or if you are using the car you will measure it as its tires if you are using a ship in you are measuring it in case of ship you will measure it at the propeller shaft and if you are just measuring bhp for engine only then you will measure it as the flywheel okay uh, are you getting ashish ah uh, yeah i got it I Yeah, it's same. I just for sake of uh, convenience, I use the same word as he was asking. So okay. So now I talk about the dynamometer. So basically, what dynamometer is? Uh, dynamometer is power consuming device. In short. Okay. So uh, there are multiple uh, types: uh, hydraulic uh, dynamometer, then we have electromagnetic dynamometer, then we have inertial dynamometer. so and uh, i think the most uh, we uh, the most like common design which we should be familiar with is uh, rope brake rope brake dynamometer 
we must have seen it in mechanical labs. I think labs are important. Tachometer is different. It measures RPM, engine RPM. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. So, uh, see, what's happening is uh, you have that shaft, output shaft, okay? There will be a pulley mounted over this. Uh, the, and we have a weight gauge, uh, the spring balance. Are you familiar with that? Spring balance. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, there is a spring balance connected at this end. And the other end of the spring balance will be connected to a rope. And that rope will cross over this pulley. And at the end of that rope, there will be a dead weight hanging. Okay. Uh, which and engine? Uh, at the end of the rope, I did catch the. There word. will be a dead dead weight, basically uh, some amount of weight, like ten ah, kg. Okay. 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 And okay. then what will you do? Uh, you will run the engine. The shaft will start rotating. Okay. Mm -hmm. Then you will observe some fluctuation at the uh, spring balance because the pulley uh, because the rope will be just pulled slightly because of the motion and friction, right? Hmm. Right. Yes. Yes. Yeah. So uh, from that reflection, uh, using some constant, I don't remember the exact formula, but using some constant at the formula, you could calculate the torque being applied at the shaft. Okay. And uh, using that torque, you can just calculate uh, the BHP formula. Whether you think it's something n times torque. Hello. Some constant. Yes. Hello. Go through the my manuals of that bike. So it says that my bike.